everybody, how are we doing today? This is Eric from Q2C VR Gamer, and we are back. And look where we are. We are in Vox Machina. This game is about to launch on the Quest 2 platform and the PC uh, platform as well um, for a campaign mode. Now, it actually has been on the PC version, has been out there, the Steam version has been out there for quite some time. Uh, but there was no campaign. It was mainly multiplayer. It was an excellent game. It was gorgeous. It was beautiful. The inside of the mech on the PC version is just stunning. It's one of the best experiences I've had uh, in PC gaming. But now it's on the Quest 2, and now they have a campaign, which is what I've been waiting for all this time. So here we are. Uh, I am jumping in for the first time with you guys. I have not done anything yet. Um, and we're just going to jump right in. And already, I can tell you, again, I'm on the Quest 2 standalone, and this looks amazing, man. Look at the size of that mech right there. It uh, looks like I'm seated at some type of control panel, and uh, let's go. We're going to start. I've got a few of those under my belt. <laughs> you can't be a captain without having a good story to tell. So... I used to fly a transport ship for Horizon Corporate. You know Horizon Corporate, right? Small mining company that had a license to mine in the Cerro system. I worked with their security team, shuttling them around from planet to planet. We That's went very cool. where the trouble was, except there was never much trouble. That was until one day, when a new pilot joined the mining crew on Topaz. Oh, look at this, man. My Holy crap! Basic logical unit engine. I am the trial AI studying that Horizon 4 is testing on randomly selected employees. My purpose is to ensure that you need your daily production code by any means necessary. Once you arrive on the surface of Planet Joe Pass, further instructions will be given. This is so cool, man. Look at this. This is just amazing. It looks so good for the quest, too. Let's see what the outside environment looks like. Look at that. So uh, right away I see it looks like we have head-based aiming, which is uh, which is kind of cool. Has been there immediately and locate the missing shipment. You can make up your quota later with mandatory overtime. <laughs> yeah, you gotta go find this guy and then you uh, you gotta make up for your lost time with a mandatory overtime. <laughs> yep, sounds like uh, sounds like America today. <laughs> The movement is so cool with this, guys. You basically just have to, like, shift and go straight, and then you don't even have to touch it anymore. It's going to go on its own. And then you just move left or right with this, with this, uh... Your radar is located in the with your right joystick. Your or your right controller. The large white circle indicates Joe's location. Head to the lo it looks like Joe is sleeping on the job again. Give him a honk to wake him up. Where was my horn again? Ah, there it is. <laughs> Keep honking, pilot. Come on, Joe, wake up, bro. Oh, hello, hello, pilot. I was just making sure that this um, shipment was stable before transporting it. Yeah, sure, right. You know, safety first, as I always say. I mean, this really gives you the feeling of being in a huge mech. It's amazing. The uh, the cockpit, the viewing window of the cockpit is so cool. I think you could change the head-based aiming if you choose to. Um, something I got to take a look at in settings. Uh, it takes a little getting used to because you're turning your. It might be might be better actually. I don't know. We'll have to see when we get into some combat. It's nice that you can just kind of put it in gear and just go. Very similar to what the game looked like on the uh, the PC version. Um, you know, of course, the PC version probably looked a little clearer, a little cleaner, a little crisper. But again, we're in a standalone quest too. This is amazing, man! It looks so good. The environments outside are great. The cockpit in here uh, in this mech is fantastic. Oh, Ooh. look who finally decided to show up! My tardy mining partner. <laughs> I've been working my fingers to the bone thanks to you. Daddy! 
Please be more careful with your laser. You almost killed me. Yeah, Donnie. You almost killed the poor dude. What? <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, it was an accident. But he totally deserved it. Holy crap, you dude. You saw how annoying that driver was? <laughs> he was telling me how to do my job. I think Donnie's lost his shit. <laughs> Why do I have to work with all these people who disrespect me? I have a right to blow up things that annoy me. I'll show them who is boss. Oh, we're gonna have to take this dude down. What in the blazes is Donnie doing? Is he attacking the refining station? Yeah. Okay. I'm not really supposed to do this, but I've given you authorization to operate a laser for combat purposes. Use it to oh. destroy one of Donnie's arms. Oh yeah, I'm gonna wreck him. Donnie is now slightly hindered. I've disabled your weapon, so just keep following him while I think of something. Well, why do you disable my weapons, this dude? Stupid job to begin with. I'm only here because I have to do mandatory community service since apparently ejecting someone out of an airlock is considered <laughs> murder. <laughs> Donnie's well, unstable, bro. Pilot, keep an eye on him. Make sure he doesn't cause any more property damage. Property damage? He's killed worry, a couple people. Corporate sort him out when he's done his rampage. And you, Frank. You're next. After I'm done turning everything to dust out here, I'm coming. Ooh, for he's you. like flying. He's got some jets I'm gonna on. make you watch as I drink all of your precious imported tea. Okay, I think it's fair to classify this as an emergency. Follow him, pilot. Keep close to me. Cody. <laughs> <laughs> he's wrecking people. For the lover, the minimum wage workers, Donnie. Did you see that explosion? Who needs workplace conflict resolution when you have lasers? <laughs> Blowing up co-workers rocks. <laughs> Take that, HR mediation. Great. Right. Holy crap. To jump. Whoa. To jump jets to pursue yeah, give me jump jets. Let's go. Use your jump jets to follow Donnie. Hey, man. Not Whoa. Like I meant to kill those people. It was an accident. All the trucks were an accident as well. And the refining station, too. <laughs> Besides, you were late to your shift, and I had to do your work. Uh-oh. So that means... I have a feeling he's going to try and kill me. That I blew everything up. Oh, yeah. Look, Donnie, it's all right. Everyone makes mistakes. <laughs> Just power down, okay? We'll launch an investigation into how your partner's tardiness caused such a terrible accident. You can completely trust us. Seriously? <laughs> That's so... Wait. You're trying to trick me. You're just gonna throw me right back in jail! Donnie, wait. I'm never this is going so cool. back. Well, it was worth a shot. Don't worry, we have backup on the way. These jump jets are awesome, Reggie, man. Reggie, our top pilot from the security team is coming in to stop Donnie. Just hang tight, okay? Hey there, Miner. Thanks for the help, but I'll take it from here. All right, kick his ass, Reggie. All right, Donnie, it's over. You're going to come with me, me out of this. Okay. You know something, Reggie? <laughs> Back up. I never liked you. Eat plasma, you corporate minion! All right, get me out of here. Oh man, what is going on there? Reggie and Donnie, you're going at it. Donnie's only got one arm, and she's still kicking Reggie's ass. Oh shit! <laughs> well, there goes our most seasoned security officer. Well, Pilot, okay. I've activated your full range of weaponry. Blast Donnie into orbit. Don't listen to anything Frank says. He's a corporate shill. Oh, you gotta go, Frank, Donnie. I told you not to listen to him. I'm warning you. It's just a flesh. 
flesh wound. Oh man, he's got all kinds of weapons on him. Damn, bro. You can manage your weapons heat by keeping my own page. Let arm pretty bolt. Let arm destroy. Oh really? Dude, oh look at this! Oh man! We got missiles! Jump. I can't jump. Oh, say goodbye to Donnie. You did it, pilot. Nice. Press A to engage in conversation. Uh, this is great, man. You actually get to get out of the uh, out of the mech and actually walk around and uh, and communicate with people. This is really cool too. All right, let's check it out. Welcome on board the Confidence. I am Horizon Security's corporate liaison, Nuru Neburu. You can just call me Neburu. Your introduction has been acknowledged. Oh, I see corporate has paired you with an AI buddy. My name is Blue. Nice to meet you, Blue. She's a little weird. So I did notice in the menu there was a lot of different options in here. So I, I, I'm currently using Smooth Turn and, uh, and and Smooth Locomotion. But there was Snap Turn. There was Teleport. Uh, pretty much anything you would need that you would normally see in a menu um, to control your uh, your locomotion, you can do it. Um, but of course, uh, you know I always want to go Smooth Turn and uh, Smooth Locomotion uh, with uh, as fast a turn as I can. Oh, well, here's an unfamiliar face. Name's Hans, Chief Engineer. Welcome aboard. Hello, essential service human. The maintenance crew's been gossiping like a bunch of busy bees. Word is that your mining partner attacked Reggie. That must have been quite a dramatic fight. Anyway, Especially for Reggie. Officer Neveru wants me to test you for any brain damage. How you doing? Who are you supposed to be? Uh, Mash Daddy Cool. You've never heard of me? <laughs> Should I sit down next door? I'm eating. See what happens. <laughs> What's up? No. Not going for it, huh? Yeah, happens to me a lot. <laughs> All right, moving on. That's funny. That's funny. All right, let's get back in the mech again, man. That's what I want. It is kind of cool that they give you an option to move around a little bit besides being in your mech, which is kind of cool. So you're not just, you know, in the mech having, you know, doing combat. You're getting out. You're uh, you're talking to people. You've got uh, some backstory to go through, which is really neat. Um, I am so impressed with this game, guys. I really am. Well, this is our security patrol. Basically, we head down the road and keep our eyes open for any shifty business. I can't believe Frank is making me train a rookie instead of just filling the vacancy himself <laughs> like he was supposed to. Relax, lady. She's super hey, uptight. Rookie, how were your jump jet skills? Think you Pretty can good. get up this ledge? Uh, I can get it up. I mean, I can get up on the ledge. <laughs> Come on, keep up. I'm going fast as I can. The finish, the sooner we can eat. These jump jets are super cool. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three, and go. One jump down, 600 more to go. 600? Let's get on with the rest of the patrol. So it looks like it does have multiplayer also. In the menu, when I picked the campaign, there was a spot that said multiplayer. And, uh... I'm looking forward to jumping into that as well. I think for right now we're just going to do the uh, the campaign, and then uh, we'll wait till the game launches, and then maybe we'll get into some multiplayer with some other people. Ooh, look at that back up there. That looks cool. Wait, who 
is that? Hello? This is Jess, Horizon Security. Can you identify yourself? No response. Check out your radar. You see that yellow icon there? That means that the hopper isn't one of our guys. If it was hostile, it would show up as red. Hmm. I wonder if they're from Pro Extractors. You should activate your scope and see if you can get a better look. How do I do that? To use the scope, press right stick button. Oh, sick. Look at that. Let's just resume our patrol. We'll worry about that hopper later. That's awesome. Rookie, we have a patrol to finish. I'm with you. Controlling the Mac is so good, man. It's really intuitive. And these jump jets are really great, man. Hey, are you seeing this? Is that another hopper? Yeah. That's not the same one from before, is it? Oh, that's a different one. Frank. Ooh, something Frank, happened. We're at the Northeast Refinery and it's on fire. Fire? You mean it's on fire? I mean, it has combusted. It's a blaze. An inferno. I could go on. Please don't. Don't. So your mech, you know, it reacts to terrain, which is really cool. So certain terrain you can move easily over, and some that's, you know, different types of terrain that's more hard to navigate, uh, you, move, move, you move much slower, just like normal. So uh, pretty cool. Make sure we don't step on anybody. Oh, good, you're here. Well, Whoa. Do you hear something? Oh, damn. <laughs> Wait, did those hoppers cause that avalanche? Screw Frank's orders. Come on, we're following these suckers. Yeah, those dudes are I've got just died, girl. You take the one on the right. Getting away. No, he's not. Don't let it get too far or you might lose it. I got him. Going now. Speedy. Yeah, he's way faster than me. Don't How lose can I? Them. Where's he going? Wait, there are three of them? There are? They're attacking our base. Damn it, Frank. I knew they were up to no good. 
Come on, rookie, we're taking them out. Took out his arm. Oh, gotta hurry. Man, well, this guy won't die. Two to go. All right. It's almost a fair fight now, isn't it? Almost. Where are you now? Okay, okay last one. Let's concentrate our fire and wrap this up. Good. Need some help here. Come in there, lady. I'm not going to get this guy's ass. Oh, nice. Good work. Babysitting you on your first day wasn't so bad after all. Heck yeah, I kicked ass. Let's head to the extraction point. Jess. Yes, sir. I cannot believe you two. You couldn't wait till after I'd done my shift to start a war, could you? Here he goes. Look, I told you that those hoppers were shifty from the start. What? Was I not supposed to do my job? Get back to the hangar immediately, both of you. Oh boy. Whatever you say, Frank. We're in trouble. All right, guys, this is probably a good spot to end this video. Um, Vox Machina on the Quest 2. This game is amazing so far, man. I loved it. I had even just the tutorial was a lot of fun. Uh, this is just the first mission uh, that I just completed. Had a ball with it. It looks gorgeous. The way the mech moves and the way you work everything is absolutely fantastic. I mean, this to me, it's a home run for these guys. I'm really impressed with it. Um, so yeah, um, my right, guys, that's it for me. Please give the video a thumbs up if you liked it. Please subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell. If you don't hit the bell, you don't know when we go live. If you don't know when we go live, you don't know when we drop new content. All right, guys. Take it easy. See you in the next one.